The Outpost, the place where you can chill and have a break if you need. It is also the place where you can upgrade to Dreadnought. And you can only reach this area if you are level 90. Otherwise it is not available for you. But you can still hang out here if you ever so wish. You can also use this to change servers whenever you want through these portals. You know what else it's for? I will tell you what else it's for. Getting completely destroyed by this killing machine of a turret. They are actually wasting their time trying to get through here. Although one of them somehow managed to get through it. That is magical. Oh, and don't forget over here. I guess for some players, it is not a waste of time. But watching players trying to get past this automated defense turret is absolutely hilarious. It's like they think something exists behind this Nexus outpost. And watching some of them lose their mind over this is completely hilarious. What are you trying to prove? What honor and glory will be bestowed upon you? If you can get past this automated turret, you cannot kill it. Many have tried. I know what it is, you just want to get over there and then show how lucky you are and how much better you are than other players. I see right through you. You cannot fool me. Get old. You know, the smartest people are those that are watching this bullshit happening right in front of them. Those are the smartest ones, not those that are trying. Some of them are trying for fun, but some of them are taking it too seriously. And to the ones that are trying it for fun, you are not dumb, I think. First tries don't count because how are they supposed to know that this would happen? So I don't count here. Seriously, I don't. This player has the spirit. Good for them. I'm wondering if these players actually think there's something behind this outpost or they just want to flex their luck to everyone else. What if this stray bullet killed both of us? Some players actually do have the right idea. The rest, not so much. Why are you so aggressive anyway? It is not that big of a deal. Well, I know why, I just won't say it. What I will say and do is push them out on purpose, just to mess with their head. As if they will listen to you anyway, with that attitude, they will not. I can certainly imagine these players internally laughing right now. They cannot see the failures, but they can also imagine it. Or they will try and destroy the auto turret with their factory drones. Yeah, these are the real dominators. You cannot destroy them. Maybe they are not as smart as I thought. And that is saying something. But hey, it's not about being smart. It's about trying. To complete a task so mundane that you get nothing out of it. And what's wrong with that in a game? Like Horacio, it was still amusing. And it became even more amusing when some players, well actually just one player, got so worked up about it. For no reason. Take some Adderall to chill yourself out. Literally. I am 100% convinced that the developers did this on purpose. Just to mess with players. Well, at the very least, there's going to be some more activity here. Because of this. Even though it mounts up to nothing. Does this exact area seem to be the goal? Well, it is. Until someone pushes you out. I would love to see this against the arena closer. Who would win? The arena closer or this impenetrable killing machine? My bet is on the killing machine because it clearly does a better job than the arena closer. Well, I'm going to go somewhere else because me being passionate about this stupid, ridiculous thing that's incredibly mundane is pointless. Sorry, did I ruin the magic for this video? That's too bad.